Uh, so it is raining outside, sitting alone in the car, been fighting a head cold for a couple of days, starting to rain even harder, and I'm gonna eat a thick burger with the ribs on it from Hardee's. This is a sad Brad tries. Oh no, don't worry, it's okay. Uh, my doctor told me that while fighting a head cold, you you definitely need a hybrid of burger and baby back ribs. I think my doctor may be a quack in that he may be an actual duck. I made sure to hold the pickles on this because I don't want to go through that scavenger hunt on this thing. All right, it's oh, it's nicely packaged and everything. Oh, that's that's nice looking. All right, so it's. There it is. There is the Carl's Jr. Hardee's baby back ribs thick burger. The ribs are pushed a little far back in there, but there you go. Hopefully there's no bones in there or that'll get really messy. As messy as the brightness going in and out on this whenever I held, whenever I held this up, it just shrouded me in darkness. Seems about right. Uh, onion straws on it too. Cause hell yes. All right, here is how I'm barbecue -y. Here's how I'm spending my uh, Saturday afternoon. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't choke, Jones. <laughs> that wasn't even that big of a bite. <laughs> That definitely tastes like the waiter spilled some ribs on my cheeseburger. <laughs> Clumsy ass waiter. <laughs> uh, well, that mostly just tastes like ribs. Like smoky barbecue ribs that happens to have a Hardy's thick burger in there somewhere. But the ribs definitely overrides the taste of the burger and the onion straws as well. Which that's unfortunate. That's usually my favorite part. Mmm. There's that sweet uh, fried oniony taste. Uh, well, <laughs> I had to think about whether or not I want to recommend this or not because a couple of weeks ago I did that unicorn frappuccino and basically said, yeah, this is nothing I'd get again, but I guess it's a why the fuck not drink. Apparently that is just a fucking nightmare for baristas to make. Like, it's a headache and a half to make that goddamn thing. I was at a con last weekend. I was at C2E2, and I guess they went ahead and just stopped making it there because it was just such a pain in the ass for them to make. So I feel kind of bad in even calling it a, a why the fuck not drink. Um, This can't be that hard to make. I, I, I imagine just, hey, what are you doing with that bucket of ribs over there? I don't know, we're just gonna throw it out. No, don't do that. This is a perfectly good burger right here. Throw those ribs on this burger. Let's take a picture of it too and put it on the window out front. Baby back ribs, thick burger. It's it's not that messy, you know. Um, it's it's not that messy at all. It's uh, it, it feels a little bit more satisfying than the apocalypse. <laughs> no, it's fine. Like it. It mostly just tastes like ribs. Honestly, you'd be better off probably just going out and getting some baby back ribs or just a rib sandwich. So, but uh, clearly it's gonna help me with my head cold. I, I, I have a feeling I'm gonna feel tons better after I eat this. Fuck. <laughs> anyway, that's that. See ya.